we're going to show you how to do a French fishtail bubble braid. So this hairstyle is just perfect for any sort of sporting event or just everyday play. Um, today we started with our half up ponytail. I like to start it a little bit further back on the hair so it's not too chunky on top. And I also did a wrap around um, and I'll show you how to do that a little bit later. Um, today we'll be just using water, a hair um, a water bottle and also my handy dandy spray gel that I love. Um, we'll also be using these clear elastics. I like the Goody Ouchless brand. We'll be using the medium size ones. Um, anyway, so let's get started. Just start out with your hair in a half pony and then we're going to be just doing um, a fishtail. If you don't know how to do it, they're very easy once you get a hang of it. Um, you start with two sections. So you just split your hair in half and then you'll just be taking a small section and putting it into the other side and then you'll just take a small section from the outer side and put it into the opposite and then you'll just keep repeating that over and over until you've gone as far down as you want. So just keep taking from the outside and putting it onto the inside of the other side. And that is how you do a fishtail. Just keep doing it. This braid does take a little bit longer than a standard um, three strand braid because if you do real, the smaller the pieces you do, the more intricate it will be. And so it does take a little bit longer, but it's super cute and I love how they, they look. Especially in this bubble style, I love the fishtail. Okay, so that's about as, as long as I want this part of the fishtail to be. So make sure you get all the hair out of the way. And then just get one of your clear elastics and tie off that fishtail and then I like to pancake it a little bit so it looks a little bit more bubbly so just carefully pull on some of those um, those outer pieces and it'll, it'll flatten a little bit just like that perfect all right I'm gonna get some water I'm gonna spray that next section that I'm gonna be working with and I'm gonna have two bubbles on her head, but three sections. So I'm just going to part to about the bottom of that bubble fish tail, or that, yeah, that bubble fish tail, right there. So then I'm gonna connect those together. Okay, now when you have that second section about where you want it, just can you hold that? Just do a pony. And then Hair out of the way. Let me 
can connect these two. And then to get this wraparound look, I just get one of my clear elastics ready. And then I just take a little piece from the bottom. This is going to cover up all your clear elastics. And then I wrap mine around a couple times. And I like to do it. You wrap around the very top of it. And then when you have just a little extra on the bottom, I just use a clear elastic and kind of just do it on the very base of that wrap. And then once it settles, it just covers up that clear elastic really nicely. See, so there you have your first section. So there you have it. Um, if you wanted to, you could put little bows in it or other stuff, but if we were going to go to a soccer game, this is probably how we just keep it just like this. Um, this would stain really well and I think it's just super cute. Alright, here's the final spin. Here's our French fishtail bubble braid. Bye bye. Thanks for watching our tutorial. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Also, follow us on Instagram for some more fun hair ideas. Bye-bye.